Well, when you come to Amazing Arcola, there is one spot you definitely need to check out for some amazing food and drinks. It's the Broomtown Cafe. That's where we are right now, taking a little bit of a break from the sun <laughs> and all the festivities outside. And Dan Kreider joins us, uh, proprietor, owner, etc. How are you, Dan? I'm good. Good to see you guys. Well, you thanks, as well. Thanks for letting us come hang out here for a little bit. So you have been open here since 2019. How have things been going? Well, COVID's been a little crazy, obviously, <laughs> but no, good. I mean, we're, we're still here, you know. Who would have thought that six months in that life would have kind of shut down? But if we can survive this, we can survive anything, That's right? That's right. For those who haven't been in, uh, talk about of the scope of what you do here. Uh, obviously, there's coffee on the menu. We're seeing some amazing desserts. What, what else do you have to offer? Yeah, so um, we're really uh, healthy, local food focused. Uh, we do a lot of local meat. I, I work with a lot of local suppliers uh, for the healthiest, freshest ingredients you can get. Um, obviously, the best coffee, really in central Illinois, I think. So check us out for that. And if you guys have a minute, I'd love to show you a couple of drinks. Quick. Please do. Yes. What are you What are you going to make? Well, I'm drinking. I just made this because if you have street food all weekend, you've got to have something a little clean, right? Sure. Oh, is that so like a detox? This is, it could be. I call it clean and green. Okay. Or mean green, clean, mean green, whatever. Uh, so that's got some spinach, some apple, some orange juice, and some banana in it. I made that for myself because I had a gyro and I got to clean my gut up. <laughs> I was going to say, I guarantee you, if I drank that thing, it would be a detox for sure. Okay. So I've got two more I'm going to show you quick. Sure. One that's also pretty healthy, and then another one that's just a fun coffee drink. So okay. Okay. Um, do you want me to should I drop yeah, it? Yeah, go for if, it. If you need both hands, then sure, I'll take the mic from you, and uh, we'll, I guess, do play-by-play -play of, uh, of what you're making. Or here, I'll come over there so you can talk and make at the same time. That'd be better. Yes. All right, I'll just hold it while you make it. All right. Tell so, us what you're doing. Um, I'm going to start with a cold brew coffee. So I've got a cup here. I'm going to put a little ice in it, and then I'm going to go drop a little bit of water and cold brew and then a really cool sweet foam uh, sweetener cream on it. So here we go. And when okay. you're done, you're going to hand that directly to me, correct? <laughs> is this, is this is my understanding how this well, works? I love that their <laughs> motto here is good food, good, what is it, good coffee, good neighbors. It's All fantastic. things good. Does okay. everybody have their own mug, Dan? I see a whole bunch of mugs with names on it over there. Does, does each customer get their own? They must be about, like MVPs, VIPs. So it's a, it's a resurgence of the local coffee club, which Charles Kuralt, back in the day, actually yeah. did an entire segment on. Uh, unfortunately, we started that in February of 2020, <laughs> and then March of 2020 <laughs> happened. Three weeks later, so, it ended. Uh, that has not gotten off the ground as much as we would like, uh, but hopefully we'll be able to, to rebuild that. So, yeah. cold brew coffee, foamy uh, sweet cream. Here we go. Ooh. That looks amazing. That does. Nice. Mr. All right, Tim. and we've got about 60 seconds to make your second drink. Can you can you do that? I have faith in him. You can show off totally the do this. fast service here at the Broomtown Cafe. Isn't that just so pretty how it just trickles down there? I, I think that's so cute. Would you, would you like to drink that one instead? You I was going to lay claim to it, but. I'm tempted. Are you? <laughs> what, is, what is the second one? I didn't hear what the second one is. I I'll tell it. you whether you should drink that one or not I based on what juice. I hear. What do you, what is it, what's in this one, Dan? Uh, what I'm making right now? Yes. Yeah. I am making a hippie refresher. This sounds up Tim's ass, Alex. <laughs> so this is a, a, a tastier, healthier alternative to the refresher drinks that you get at, you know, the other places that shall not be named. Sure. That's right. Uh, starts out with hippie tea, which is herby and minty. So it's actually healthy, not too much sugar, a little bit of real fruit flavor that's got green coffee extract for a tiny bit of caffeine kick. Mix it up in a shaker. Pour it out, wild berry hibiscus wow. refresher. Perfectly to the top. All right, which one are you going to take, Miss Roberts? I'll go to the coffee because I All know right. you're not a big coffee drinker. I'll be a hippie. Lance straws. Oh, oh okay. Are you concerned we're going to be messy? Because that's fairly concerned. likely. Let's remind everybody where you're located here in Amazing Arcola. 130 East Main Street. Okay. Check us out for good food, good coffee, good neighbors. I love it. I All feel right. like a hippie already. Yes. It's very good. Dan, thank you so much. <laughs> Appreciate this is it. wonderful. If you want more information on Broomtown Cafe and everything they've got going on here, we'll connect you at CILiving.tv.